Okay, all right, guys, check this out. I've got uh, a little time. I'm flying the goose right now, but I wanted to put this together for you, even aficionados. Uh, look at the arm structure going into the slot there at the top of the swing where uh, the right elbow is underneath the left elbow already. Left arm a little bit under the shoulder plane, right? The line of the left shoulder to the right shoulder, and right leg straight. So let's just play that back. Very comfortable over the ball, tall stance. Left knee bends, right hip steps back into the heel, arm structure up into the body. Now this is where it gets juicy. So right elbow by the right red circle there, depicting that it's not in front of the hip. It's actually at the right side of the hip. Okay, the uh, left arm is very vertical, and it would be impossible to get the elbow vertical if the elbow, excuse me, left arm vertical if the elbow was out in front of the hip. So his hands are very, uh, very close to his body still. Hands are directly under his neck. And um, so anybody that's trying to get your elbow in front of the rib cage can never get this spot here. Now, Hogan's super fast hands, right? So he lets this thing fly. And I'm going to show you from our front view what is happening and what is not happening. So at impact here, right, there goes the ball. You can see his hips are wide open or belt buckled to the target. Uh, right shoulder still down, etc. Now the tip, there's something kind of interesting for sure. The tip of the left shoulder there and then check for the right shoulder. It's nowhere near that at impact, right? So it's closer to him at impact. So it hasn't spun out to where the left hip was. Okay, so that's some side bend kicking in there. So if you're all thinking that, you know, replacing the shoulder with the other shoulder, that's not the case. When you just take a look at the shoulder plane or line now, I'll draw that in green. And you're going to clearly see it here like that and play that out, you're going to see two different looks here. So he's hit the ball or just about hitting the ball. Right shoulder did not get out to the uh, green dot. And now, in red, the shoulders are more vertical. Very important. Uh, so, let's see, why is the, uh, the man himself? Going to go to the...
front view here. I'll clear all this out so we can get a little fresh start here. Like I said, on the plane uh, on the way to Germany and then over to Mykonos, Greece for two weeks. Solo working on a swimming vacation. Uh, here's Hogan from the front view. Beautiful view here. Uh, the gorgeous setting of the club, etc. And now from here, you can already see the right elbow peeking underneath the left. And as he gets into impact, I'll see if I can slow that down right there. So the uh, right arm is up against the right side of the body. Now, what's the deal then? Well, that right side of the body moved all the way to here. I mean, it, it's moving laterally. So he's stepping onto that left leg and the left hip. And the view is not exactly perfect. You see the left knee is outside of the ankle, right knee. And the body has shifted big time over to the left leg allowing that right arm to stay in position even as he starts turning still to the side of his body and side of his hip uh, and then of course the, the beautiful alignments of mr hogan there on the way out the exit so some really cool things to kind of uh understand here there's definitely uh no flicking going on he hasn't even hit the ball yet he's already the ball is just getting struck here and you can see the hips are probably 80 degrees open the shoulders are super tilted. The right arm is snug up against the side. The pressure point number five on the right arm is intact. The pressure point number four under the left arm wel welded on there. Left arm straight down here on the body. Then he just does the Hogan. Releases that right hip up into the sky. Gorgeous. So I hope you guys... Uh, hear that clearly and get an idea of uh, what's going on here and maybe some uh, messages and perhaps we can do a zoom call while I'm in Greece and go through some alignments and figure this out together. Masters of the Game uh, website is out. Hit me up and I'll send you a link for that. It's only uh, uh, 100 people for the first uh, few months are going to allow it in. So just letting you know that's up and running. Uh, it's going to be launched in Greece actually. All right guys.